everyone so this is the brand new Vito Pro Pack MV5B tool bag now there's two versions of this there is a tester bag version for the UK market if you have a mega test from test equipment or the tool bag version which I've got now I'm a UK plumber a maintenance plumber got this about three days ago four days ago used it all yesterday uh, set it up over the weekend played around with my setup and I have to say it's a really really nice bit of kit so from the front you've got your standard MB look, you've got your TP XXL style side pockets, all front sided access apart from an iPad pouch on the back. It's standing about 15 and a half inches high to this point, from here to sort of here roughly about 18 inches and about 10 inches front to back fully loaded out. So first you've got your main big front pocket, which I've got a parts pouch, you've got a stretchy pocket, you've got your little webbed clear um, sort of parts pouch there. And then you've got a little pocket with your bit, da, bit driver style pockets in that. I've got a couple of pipe slices, but still plenty of room to put extra. And as you can see, these pockets are expandable as well. Your side pockets, like I say, from your TPXXL, we'll come back to them. Now, it's got a drop down panel. So when this drops down, you've got a retention strap, which is adjustable and removable. But the whole point is that it stops the front dropping on the floor. Uh, obviously remove it if you wish. Full V-swap, so you've got a V-swap panel here with four large sort of tool pockets. You've got a main V-swap panel at the very back and two side V-swap panels which are removable and can be fitted into the side pockets, which I'll show you. Uh, now, I chose to have all the uh, V-swap panels in the front, front sided access, so when I drop the bag down, I can literally just work out the front of it. And the stuff I've got in the side pockets, I need now and again. Uh, really nice bit of kit. You've got all your stretchies at the back, very stretchies. Um, I've put all my main little tools that I require sort of quite quickly, what I use commonly in the front, and anything that I quick grab stuff at the front. But even stuff that's a bit deeper down in the back of the bag, easy grabbed and returned to its place. Um, really nice bit of kit. I really enjoyed using this yesterday. Uh, and I am generally a tote person, so that says a lot for the bag for me. Um, Side pockets, similar to the TPXXL, you've got your little pockets on the side here, uh, and then full zippers. Now, I might be wrong on this, but I have a feeling on the TPXXL, the zipper only comes part way down on this side. Now, I fitted out my TPXD the uh, these spot panels and slipped them in the slip pockets here. They're a little bit tight doing it, but it's worked well, and I'm using this as sort of a drill driver pen, you know, nut driver pocket. Anything to do with drills and pens and nut drivers and uh, bit drivers for uh, your impact drivers so it works really well that and I'm not in this a lot so hence the reason I've sort of put it all in the side pocket. Now these side pockets are roughly about ten and a half inches inside probably about four four and a half inches across which apparently is the same as the TPX XL <coughs> and then in this side pocket again you've got your main pocket your pocket at the front you've got your tape mount which you've also got on the other side obviously um, and I've just got a few taller tools in this. You've got this stretchy pocket here, uh, and these are your slip pockets that effectively, these removable V-swap panels here, which has got two pockets and one large front pocket. You can slip that onto one of these pockets and put a few smaller tools in there if you wish. And now on the rear, you've got your iPad pouch, which is a sort of new style padding, really well. Now I've got an iPad 12.9 and that fits in and it comes up to about here and about an inch above it and but it will comfortably bend over and seal it in properly. Now what a new feature is is uh, removable backpack straps. So you've got these hook system which passes down the back of the webbing and then back up on the webbing. Uh, but obviously completely removable so I've removed these because I don't use backpacks. I've fitted a shoulder strap because you've got your standard D-rings on the side. Uh, and it got full versatility with this bag and that's the whole point of it it's just you can swap and change it around but one of the, obviously the main features for me that I like is the fact that once I plunk that bag down I can use it all from the front like I say and you can remove all the panels if you wish you know you can just have to the main panel in the back put these in here uh, you can take this off you can have a full um, book storage panel in it if you wanted to and just load it out with big you know with bigger tools power tools whichever you want to do like I say a lot of versatility but a really nice bag nice size um big enough generous enough but not getting to the point where it's you know it's, it's too big to carry or too heavy to carry so that is the Vito Pro Pack MB5B thanks a lot